Hola chicos. So remember when I told you that there were no stem changing verbs in the preterite tense for AR verbs? I have good news. There are no stem changers for ER verbs either. And then I have half good news. For IR verbs that were stem changers in the present tense, IR verbs alone, they will stem change in the preterite tense. But like I said, it's half good news because they only partially stem change in the preterite tense. So let's go back and review some of our stem changers that are IR verbs. We had pedir, to order or to request. Dormir, to sleep. Morir, to die. Servir, to serve. Seguir is a new one for you, to follow. Sentir, to feel. And divertirse, to have fun. Originally, pedir was pido, pides, pide, pedimos, piden. Let's see what it would look like in the preterite tense. Now it's pedi, pediste, pidio, pedimos, pidieron. Where does it stem change in every single form? No, it no longer stem changes in the boot. It now only stem changes in the el, ella, usted, as well as the ellos, ellas, ustedes forms in the third person singular and plural. So instead of calling these boot verbs, we've gone from winter boots in the present tense to now summer sandals in the preterite tense. Now they're called sandal verbs in the preterite tense because they only stem change at the very bottom. Look at dormir. In the present tense, it was duermo, duermes, duerme, dormimos, duermen. In the preterite tense, it's dormi, dormiste, durmió, dormimos, durmieron. Where did it stem change? In the sandal. However, look at that. It didn't go from O to UE. It partially stem changed O to U. Durmió, durmieron. How about sentir? In the present tense, it was siento, sientes, siente, sentimos, sienten. In the preterite tense, it's sentí, sentiste, sintió, sentimos, sintieron. It's stem changed again in the sandal, only the third person singular and plural. But again, it's a partial stem change because it's only E to I. So remember for IR verbs that were stem changers in the present tense are now sandal verbs in the preterite tense, except for they only partially stem change from E to I and O to U, and only in the third person singular plural. If it's an AR verb or an ER verb that we have learned was a stem changer in the present tense, forget about it. You don't have to worry about that. It's only the IR verbs. And the list I gave you are the most common ones. Y es todo. Adios.